Well, folks, thanks for joining me again. We're playing some more Dragon Age Origins. We have finally arrived at Soldier's Peak. Awesome. Awesome. I was able to, <laughs> in between episodes, reconfigure all their personal things, but then the game locked up on me, and now they've reset back to... <sighs> sustain powers... That's an active power, that's an active power, that's a sustained power. This is, who is this? This is Alistair. Okay, so we can go into shield cover. Greater chance of deflecting missile attacks, shield mastery, blah blah blah. It gives you 5% fatigue. Okay, great. Oops. Choose the leader again here. Come on. Actually, I wonder, is there a way to reconfigure these guys in order there. Reorder them. Alright, well, we're gonna try this out. Soldier's Peak. Find out what's up here. It looks awesome, so I'm pretty excited about this. Nope. Oh, I thought we were under attack, but nope. Fall back! Fall back already! Taking the peak will not be easy, my lord. I gave the Wardens one chance to die with honor. Instead, they hole up like cowards. We follow the King's advice, then. Starve them out. But the Peak has months of supplies. Then we wait. When they are too weak to lift their weapons, we will send them to their final judgment. Whoa, what was that? Felt a bit woozy there. I'm not mad, am I? You saw it too. like a walking dream. How is that possible? This place truly is haunted. <sighs> the world is full of mysteries and that's yes, why we Wolf. play this game, Levi. Levi, whatever the hell your name is nowadays. Um, ooh, all kinds of things. We can go that away, we can go this away. Awesome. Love it. <laughs> Okay, now we're under attack. Oh, they're decided to get up. Okay, so you. You get him. You get him. You get him. You. Shoot your lightning bolt. And hit I go. Okay, so. Hit him. Okay, now. Let's. You go into you got like five things. Um threaten that's not the one I was looking for, I don't think. Powerful swings. Let's activate that. Ooh, there's a shitload of guys here. Alright, so go up here. No, use that um hmm, this thing. Somebody's stunned, okay. Good so far. You get him, you get him. Alistair. Yeah, what's all that guy? You come here. Um, oh, she didn't. It was the other wizard that had that other power. Horror is probably not going to work that well. Keep going, boys. Everybody, hit the guy that's down. That's always a challenge. Oh. Good, 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 good. Over here, you. Come on, here. That did not work as I thought. Sorry. Vulnerability. Uh, it's not even wasted because. So it looks like there's only one guy left. Alright, good job, my team. Oh shit, here comes a whole new group. You guys, get over here. Oh, I forgot to equip all the stuff I bought for them, too. You put on that. Right. Everybody. Start attacking. 
Okay, better yet, everybody come over here so the archer can blast you in the face. Yo! Dude, I said over here. Right there. Where you should be. Okay, everybody. Alright. As you say. Whoa. She's still getting hit by her. Oh, there he is, right there. Damn it. You start concentrating on that. Alistair's hurt again. Jeez, come on, drink another potion. Alistair, hello. Drink a potion. Come on, everybody attack him. Another lightning bolt. Take him off a hold. You drink a potion. Drink a potion. Alistair, you drink a potion. What? You two go after that guy. Do you have your lightning bolt to do? Alright, come up. They will hurry up. Alright. Well, more? What the frick? Hello, everybody. Home position, get over here. Alright, why well, we got a second? You drink a potion. Alistair, you drink a potion. Alright. Now, everybody. Kill! You go get the archer. You cast lightning. Let's try this power out. Man, this is kind of attack they got going on here. Go get him! What are you waiting for? You. Come here. Lightning bolt. Back there. Oh, didn't matter. Okay, now. Holy Moses, that was quite an attack. Take a health potion, absolutely. We got stuff everywhere. Oh, fire bolts. A new. Warden crossbow. An elixir of grounding. A flask of clear blue. Electrical damage. Okay, I take all that. Oops, wait a minute. Let's go uh, gather our goodies up here. Health potion, good. Health potion and some money, that's good. Looks like some money up here as well. Come on, get up the path. Uh, some copper pieces and some more copper pieces. Okay, well, the heck of a start, and better yet, we have a level up on one of our characters. So, we're going to give her 
Oops. Willpower. We're going to give her... Um, crank that up. Give her a little more hit points. Shape shifter. She needs to be level 8, so we can't do that yet. Mains. Arcane shield protects it. Gain a bonus to defense while this mode is active. That's nice. Flaming weapons. This spell is active. The caster enchants the party's melee weapons. Yes, that is what we want right there. Oh, I can't do that one yet. Because I have to do that one. Hmm. Let's see what else they have first. Creating a bonus for armor as long as this mode is active. Uh, she's already got Winter's Grasp. Winter's Gasp. So maybe Frost Weapons. Hmm, okay. So instead of maybe doing fire, we can give everybody cold. That might be worth uh, worth doing. Oh, this might need uh, Cone of Lightning, damaging all targets. Wonderful. What else do we have? Healing. The, ha the caster ca causes flesh to knit miraculously instantly healing an ally by a moderate amount. Gaining a bonus to attack. Hmm. Okay. Wow. All kinds of stuff. Hmm. So she's already got a couple in Primal. Uh, she's got one in Spirit and a couple in, in Tropic. So, flex penalties to cold resistance. Yeah, yeah. Not interested in that. Death Magic. Um, walking Bomb. Ooh. So, force field around someone. That could be kind of helpful, actually. Um, hmm. Let's, let's do that one. And play. So now if we look at her character, there it is. Force field. Okay. Excellent. So now she's a level 7 mage. That should help. Next level up, she should get a bonus. Can we get in any doors here? Nope. Alright, we're just gonna kind of walk around the outer perimeter here, just kind of surveying lay of the land, as they like to say. Just to compare what's going on here. See if there's any goodies hidden anywhere, some chests or anything. I don't see anything. Alright, so the question is do we go up the door or do we walk up here and see what's up here? I think we walk up here. Let's, let's look in the forest real quick just to see if there's any plants. There is not. There's nothing there. I do see somebody or some things. Oh, uh, maybe that's a statue. Okay. We will investigate this area a little bit. Let's examine the statue. Just qualified for specialization, a customized form of a character's class base. Each offers a unique set of advanced talents and benefits. Characters may have up to two test specializations, with the first becoming available at level 7 and the second at level 14. But first, you need to find a trainer. Shoot. Well, that kind of sucks. I did level up. Yay! So we can get Assassin, which gives us extra dexterity and extra critical chance, extra willpower and cunning, nature resistance and constitution, or dexterity and plus one damage per hit. I think I like duelist actually, because I am fighting with two weapons. 
So that's good. Um, so we're going to put a, all three points, or whatever points we have, three points into dexterity there. <coughs> and see where that takes us. So we get improved tools, which is uh, trickier locks. Yes. Lock picking and trap disarming. Yes. All right. All right. Now, I keep forgetting, and now that I remembered, <coughs> it's time to get into our inventory and check out what we have here. We've got a few new things. <coughs> so some of the things I got uh, mm -hmm. from the vendor back at the mm -hmm. thing was these Bard's Dancing Shoes, which are going to give um, to Sven. It's going to give him extra armor, a lower fatigue penalty, plus six to his defense, and reduces hostility. So we're going to put those on him. And if we do that, let me see if we lose... Uh, we do lose our item set bonus. Hmm... That's alright. Well, maybe let's look at Alistair then. Is he getting shield cover, item set bonus? And I bet you if we put these on, yes, he loses Zeus as well. Damn. Alright, let's look at my character then. Uh, Theron. Right now, I'm just using those. Um, did I lose? Do I have a... I do have an item set bonus. Damn. Losing my bonuses. Their light boots are the same thing. Alright, well, I think they're that much better. I will lose my bonus. That's fine. So... Drake skin. Okay, so plus six to my defense and reduces hostility. I'm not sure what that means. Let's see if it tells us inspect. Reduces hostility. What does that tell us? <laughs> can't click on that. It doesn't pop up a window, so I'm not sure. Hmm, damn it. It's a lot better armor. Slightly fatigues me, but I get better defense and reduces hostility towards me, I think. The other thing I was able to purchase was... where Where is it? I think there was two things I purchased. What were they? Hmm. I think it was something for Alistair. Let me see if I already... Oops, it's not Alistair. Let's see if I already put it on him. Um, I thought it was for Alistair. Oh, well maybe it was for... Yes, I think it was for Alistair. Because he didn't have a helmet, so I got a better helmet. Well, I bought a helmet for him. And, oh, he's still getting his items. Okay, so that's good. So it must be just three, these three must match up. Okay, anyways. Um, so we came down here. It doesn't look like there's anything other than this location. Okay, fine. Nothing this way. It looks like we're headed inside, folks. So that was a pretty good trap they had set up there. All those dead skeletons. Second level. First, you must find a trainer. Okay. I'm not sure if that means. Let's look at this again. Um, let's see if it shows us us a duelist. It does show us as a duelist and a rogue and a Danish elf and an elf and a level seven. And fatigue wearing armor causes fatigue, which is a percentage increase of the basic stamina or mana cost to activate a spell or channel. Which is a percentage increase. So I'm getting 3.6% increase. Um, if we put on back on these other boots. We get our iron set bonus and we're at 3.5. Okay, so I think these boots are worth it because they give us quite a big up swing. And defense. Let's see what our defense is. Defense... Let's see if we can find it. Resistances. Physical resistance. Defense. I don't see it. It's probably staring me in the face. 
Uh, maybe this is it. Damage. No, that's damage. Attack. Oh, there it is. Defense. So it's normally 68. I'm getting 11 because of my bonuses. So 79. That's not bad. He's got no defense. He's got minus 10. Missile deflection. Attack is minus 4. Wow, why is he so... Because he's wearing the big heavy armor of it. Well, anyways. We're going to get to go inside, folks. So, um... Stand tuned for the next episode where I think we're going to actually get to see what's inside the castle. So thanks for watching.